But a lot of women do complain, oh, my husband's always on me. Why is he always on me? Mm -hmm. If sex is going to be a chore for you that you don't really want to do, why do women constantly push monogamy on men? If you know that you don't want to have to deal with him all the time just wanting you, mm -hmm. why do you push monogamy? If you wanted monogamy, okay. why would you want monogamy if monogamy, if, if sex is a chore for you? That's the question. You're avoiding the question. I'm not avoiding the question, but at first you said me, women, or, or in general me specifically, are pushing monogamy on somebody. Okay, yes, that's something that I wanted. But I didn't press you for it and be like, I'm going to hold a gun to your head to propose to so me. Because if I knew that marriage and monogamy was going to involve me trying to meet you where you were at sexually for years to come, then I probably would have reevaluated if I wanted to be monogamous anyway. This is why a woman must earn your commitment as well as never allow her to get too comfortable in a relationship. I want to read this passage to y'all. She doesn't want to work hard later in the relationship. Her highest level of effort will always be in the beginning and then slowly diminish over the duration of the relationship. It's because she's accustomed to using her attractiveness and sex appeal as her only real part in the relationship. This is why she stops keeping herself up as the relationship goes along also. She just wanted to make sure that she could gain your commitment. Once she has your commitment, then what else does she have to work for? Women are great relationship starters, but have a hard time keeping up their emotional drive in relationships. This is why a lot of men get the best of women in the beginning, you know, sex to sexless marriages, right? When you met her, she was in shape. Now she can gain weight. And the list just goes on, you know, uh, the effort she put in in the beginning. Maybe she was uh, more pursuing of you or she had more time for you. And as the relationship progress, you know, you're, you're an afterthought. You're not a priority anymore. This passage explains it greatly. She doesn't want to work hard later in the relationship. Her highest level of effort will always be in the beginning of the relationship and slowly diminish. This is because she's trying to gain your commitment. So you must leverage your commitment and never allow a woman to get too comfortable to get the best experiences out of her. Salute. As a woman, because I don't. I don't want to say it's a man versus woman thing, but a lot of women do complain. Oh, my husband's always on me. Why is he always on me? Mm -hmm. If sex is going to be a chore for you that you don't really want to do, why do women constantly push monogamy on men? If you know that you don't want to have to deal with him all the time just wanting you, mm -hmm. why do you push monogamy on men? Well, who's to say I pushed anything on anybody? Like, Well, we know that people, you pushed monogamy on me. I pushed monogamy. I forced you to get married to me? Time out. I didn't say you forced me to get married, but you, did you not say to me, that you wanted to be engaged and you wanted to be married before you live with me? You didn't I, want, say that? I want a billion dollars. That don't mean I'm going to get it. I but, can want but something, asking, but not... You, you, right now, you're dodging the question. Nobody pressed you to, to do it. Yes, is that something I wanted? Yes, it was. But... You didn't press me? To, are you going to lie now so to the people because we're talking about sex? Deval, you're going to lie now to the people? Deval. Knowing Come in, you strong, didn't want monogamy? Of course I did. So then why are you avoiding the question? That's not avoiding the question. I'm saying, does that mean because I want it and I requested that, that you were going to deliver it? Like, nobody pressed you for that. Tell me, you just said you wanted it and requested it. Do you not hear yourself? I can make a request. Is the request going to be granted? Am I not? Am, you, I, am I not granting you monogamy? You are granting it to so, me. So this is my question. Look this is my question. Always look at this. Look at this. Look at your boy. Look at your boy. This is my question. If you wanted monogamy, okay. Why would you want monogamy if monogamy if, if sex is a chore for you? That's the question. You're avoiding the question. I'm not avoiding the question, but at first you said me, women or, or in general me specifically are pushing monogamy on somebody. Okay, yes, that's something that I wanted, but I didn't press you for it and be like, I'm going to hold a gun to your head to propose to so me. Come out. Because if I knew that marriage and monogamy was going to involve me trying to meet you where you were at sexually for years to come, then I probably would have reevaluated if I wanted to be monogamous anyway. So that's fair, but we're not even, even talking about marriage. Let's even talk about dating, right? Okay. Two people people are dating typically in society who asks for exclusivity first a woman or a man i would say a woman i don't think that i was necessarily prepared or in the mindset to know that it's almost like once you get into it then you're like oh shoot like this is what i'm gonna have to keep up with i get that us speaking as 36 year old people know that now had i known that at 26 i get that i would have to contend with that I even that. in the dating realm I then it might have been something i would have reevaluated now had said to me one morning he was like and this is when it clicked to me right he was like when you wake up in the morning what's the first thing you think about I said, well, open my eyes, thank God for another day. And then I'm like, all right, well, what do I got to do for the day? The kids have this, that, the third. I got to do this, that, and the third work. Um, everything else in between, all my errands I have to run. Uh, why? And he was like, so where do I fall in the list of things that you think of? Mm -hmm. I said that to her. And I was like, New Year's oh. Eve, 2020. I was like, and that was like a gut punch to me because I was like, wow, I'm really out here covering all these bases, but the one base that always holds me down. Mm -hmm. How dare me? 
And at that moment, I said, never again will I do that. That's good. So now it's a thing where when we wake up in the morning or even before we go to bed at night, we'll have a little recap of the day. What do you have going on tomorrow? You wake up in the morning, babe. How are you feeling? How's your spirit? How you, you know, what do you need help with today? What can I take off your plate to alleviate a little bit of stress mm. or a little bit of confusion or something? And it could be something so simple. You know how hard it is for a man to try to be monogamous to a woman. And then when he's ready to have sex, the woman act like he's being, like she's bothering him. Especially when you're in relations for a long time. There's a lot of women who are just like, oh my God, you want to have sex again? It's like, yo, I'm trying to be everything to you and only give you this. This is what I need. And then you act like it's a bother. And then when you have sex, it's like, fine, yeah, take it. So now we have wax sex when we have sex. Or you don't want to have sex and you expect me to live like Like that. that. So then dude's like, you know what? I can't keep saying it because I don't want to bother her. So let me just go try to get it. Then he get caught. Now he the bad can I get yeah. my wings? Yeah, annoying. Can you think so? Get my wings? I'll go back for my grub and all that. All right, go ahead. I'm going to check my alerts on my phone. Yeah, it's a little thick, so go ahead. Check see, my alerts on my phone. See, my shorts, she got the shorts on. I like. She got the shorts on. I like. You see that? That's all I asked for. That's all I asked for as a husband. That's all I asked for. I appreciate you, baby. 